Good morning out there in the DFS community. It's Vaughn, the stat man, coming into your YouTube airwaves, and welcome to the stat room. Woo! How is everybody doing this wonderful morning? All right, ladies and gentlemen, before I get into my picks, let me get into my positive word. And my word for this fine morning is unstuck. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we all have trials and tribulations and we all have bad things happen to us. Murphy's Law will knock on your door at some point in time. No matter how hard you train, you're going to just have days where you're just stuck. The way to get unstuck is to reinvent yourself every day. To work on yourself daily. Recreate yourself. And you decide that you're going to stand up to life. And you live every day. You know, whether it's good or bad, because life is cyclic, it's going to have ups, downs and all that, but it's not going to stay bad. So just know that and wake up loving yourself and finding a reason to do what you do. Like when you find your why, you'll get unstuck. So guys, in life, work on yourself daily to get unstuck. And I'm going to leave it there with Unstuck, guys. All right, guys, before I get into my picks, let me introduce myself, guys. I am Vaughn the Statman, and you can follow me on Twitter, at Vaughn the Statman. And, guys, check out the website, VaughnTheStatman.com. And I appreciate it if you hit the like button before we begin, because I know you're going to like my video. And also, leave a comment if it's something you want to talk about or you have any questions you want to ask. This is our page, guys. This is our video. So leave comments. I love to read the comments. That's how I know what to talk about in my videos. All right, guys. So let's get right into it, guys. Um, so yesterday, we started a three-day streak. Um, FanDuel is now on a three-day winning streak, and so is DraftKings. And guys, I talked about how to play fantasy a few days ago. So let me, re let me um, add to that. All right. So let's just say you play twenty dollars a day. You take ten dollars and you play, and you play head-to-head -head contests that you create. Now you must create these head-to-head -head contests about fifteen minutes prior, because a lot of the sharks they have their game set forty-five minutes to an hour prior, and all they do after that is just adjust if a player is not playing or something, and they 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 add a player or subtract. Next, you take. You got $10 in your head-to-heads that you create. Next, you put five in your double-ups. And then you put five in your single entry. I don't even recommend unlimited entry GPPs. But that's the way to, to play because on an off night, your head-to-heads could have you break even. On a great night, you win all four. It's phenomenal. Your single entry, you, you might play a $5 single entry, win 50 bucks. You win all your head-to-heads, you know, and then that $20 investment could now be 70, 80 bucks. But on an off night, you're still gonna win some of your some of your head-to-heads, so you're not gonna have nights where you lose completely. So that's how you play the smart way. You treat it like stock. You have like like a stock, you have some in mutual funds, some in high risk stocks, some in bonds. That's what that's how I play fantasy. So if you play that way, you'll have less heartache and pain, and it will become fun. All right, guys, so that's enough with that. So let's get into my picks. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so now it's time for my picks. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so yesterday, the, um, the four horsemen did okay. So today, we're going to start off. It's coming off of a bad game. But guys, he's a right-handed pitcher. He has a 4.68 ERA. He's 7,500. He's, he's versus Miami. Now, Miami is not a home run hitting team. And Miami Miami's ballpark is one of the best pitcher-friendly ballparks in the league. It's hard to hit a home run in Miami. So even if Lynn gives up a few hits, I don't see him getting blasted like he did in the hitter-friendly ballpark in New York. So Lynn is our first play. All right, so next we're going to go and get... We're going to go for second baseman, McNeil. All right, so McNeil, he plays for the New York Mets. He has a 3-2-6 batting average, which is 
phenomenal guys. He's 2,700 and he's versus the San Francisco Giants. I think McNeely gets a few hits and hopefully someone is on base. Maybe he'll get us 10 to 12 points. And for his price point, we'll take it. All right, so next, I'm going to give you third baseman, Camargo. Now, Camargo is one of my favorite hitters, guys. You know, when this guy is very consistent, he's a switch hitter. He has a 268 batting average. He's only 3,100, and he's versus Pittsburgh. And now Pittsburgh is another place where it's hard to hit a home run, but I think Carmega can get a few hits. And same with McNeil. If a guy's on base, he can bring a run in. All right, guys, so last but not least, the boomstick play of the night is none other than Carpenter. All right, guys, I'm giving you Matt Carpenter. The, the St. Louis Cardinals are red hot. You better fear these red birds because these birds are on fire. Now, he's a left-handed hitter, guys. He has a 272 batting average. He has 34 home runs. Now, he is 4,100, and he's versus Los Angeles. It's a little harder to hit a home run in Los Angeles, Los Angeles, but not as hard as Pittsburgh and San Francisco. This Matt Carpenter guy, since he started eating that salsa, he's been on fire. I think I'm going to go and try to run up in his locker and steal some of that salsa because he is balling. All right, guys, so that's it. Len, McNeil, Cam Camargo, and the boomstick player of the night is Carpenter. All right, guys, so I'm on to today. So, guys, don't forget to win-win. That means give people what they want so you can get what you want. And, guys, don't forget to think and ink. That means write it down so that way it can come true. And, guys, the way to get unstuck is to reinvent yourself and decide that you're going to stand up to life. Love you guys.